Yeah, for sure. I mean, he's, he's a great player. Um, just his ability to extend plays, just in the pocket, he's really good, really accurate. And um, I mean, the year he's had it kind of speaks for itself. But I think it's also cool his, his journey to get here and, you know, what he's had to go through. It's, it's, it's really cool. So, but yeah, he's a great player and it's going to be, it's going to be a good matchup. Yeah. Yeah, I think uh, I'm really happy for him. First of all, just excited that he's going to get that opportunity. And um, I think the best thing about him is the kind of person he is. And just everyone says that, but it's true. You know, I've got the chance to talk to him a couple times. And it's just really cool uh, the position he's in. And just he's really down to earth, just a really good guy. And But I mean, he's a great player. He's going to do well. And I'm excited to watch him. And uh, hopefully he gets back healthy quick. But I mean, he's a great player. When we played him, I know it was. It was a challenge, just how accurate he is and his threats down the field is just, you know, it's really hard to prepare for that, but um, he's going to do great. So. Not really. I think it, you know, you get a, you have a new team the next year. We lost a lot of those guys. We got new guys here that, that weren't there. So you don't, you can't really lean on that or you'll end up getting beat. So I, we, we just started over and said, hey, this is a new team. Like this team hasn't won anything. You know, that was last year's team that, that won that. So that was what we, we had to just start over. Yeah. Yeah, it's kind of hard, but you realize like, I mean, after the game for maybe a week, people care that you won. And then after that, it's like, okay, who's going to win next year? So it's, Everyone's already talking about next year, a couple of days after. So it, it's it's not as hard as you would think to kind of move on and transition and say, okay, now let's do it again this year. So it's really not not that hard because everyone else is they're not they don't really care about last year anymore. They want to see who's going to do it again or who's going to win next year. So that's yeah. I don't know. I haven't. Uh, I haven't really seen him. I haven't watched enough to to see him actually really break out and and run along. I I have no idea, honestly. Um, I really don't know. <laughs> It's really special, um, you know, not, not just for the guys that, that were here last year, you know, obviously it's really special for us to have the opportunity to do it again, uh, but, but the guys that haven't been here, it's, it's really cool, you know, seeing the freshmen that, that weren't here last year getting to experience it, and then also just, like I said, just it's, it's cool being a part of something where you set out to do at the beginning of the year, you have these goals, and, you know, you feel like you're the only people that really believe in it, and it, it's cool to be able to actually accomplish those things and get to the moment to where, you know, you, you get to kind of decide what you want to do. Do you want to, you know, want to win the game or not? So it's, it's really cool to have the opportunity to, to win the national championship for sure. You know, it's I don't I don't think much has changed. You know, besides that, you know, the team we're playing is a lot different. Obviously, so that's a big difference. But the moment is, you know, it's special both times. It's it's a really cool thing to be a part of, and both are a little bit unique, but the same in just the moment and, and how special it is. Yeah, I think just not making the moment too big. I don't think I did last year, but just really learning from last year that, you know, playing in the game and, be, and being able to win the game is just realizing it's it's just another game and, and not making it too big and just 
um, but taking in every moment as well, and you know, focusing on the moment and not the magnitude of the moment. So that's going to be it's going to be really fun just to be here with these guys and, and really just enjoy it and not you know not put pressure on ourselves, but just enjoy being here. I think it's just, um, I mean, every every week's different in football. You never know, like just the teams you're playing, and um, it's just it's just different every week. So you got to come every week with the same mindset of preparing and um, playing just one game at a time. And you know, it's kind of it's kind of easy to lose lose focus of that for sure. So I think just for me, the biggest thing was just staying locked in and focused and realizing that I want to finish better than I started, and I want to you know take this momentum into the postseason. And that's when we play our best is in this time of year. So that's biggest thing for us, it doesn't really matter how I started, how we started, it's just we want to finish well. During championship what? Sorry. Yeah. Um, I don't know. I don't know, honestly. That's, that's a tough question because do you mean like national championship or the um, – I think it's cool the – the different places we get to go. Last year we were in California and Santa Clara. It's way different than here, so it's it's cool getting to experience kind of both sides, um, just the cultures. I think that's probably my favorite part is getting to go to new places and you get to do it with with guys that you've been you know you've been in school with for a couple of years and guys that you you know become your best friends. So I think that's the coolest thing. It just just a grinder. I mean, uh, he's like. The ultimate team guy, you know, he doesn't get any uh, recognition, any of that, but just comes to work every day and and whatever he's doing, he, he tries to be the best. So I think when I think a guy like that, just a really good teammate, and he's one of, he's one of my best friends. So just uh, he's really special to me, and I think just the way he works, and he's very selfless. It's, it's really cool to see. Yeah, I'm. Uh, I'm ready. We've had a lot of media days, a lot of, uh, you know, we had a couple at the the Fiesta Bowl, then this one. Now I'm, I'm ready just to practice and, and really get to the game. Honestly, it's uh, this isn't like a bowl week experience. It's condensed, so we're just kind of ready to go ahead and get our prep and, and get out there and play. Um, I think just. I don't know if I'm necessarily tired of it, but the, the most asked question, I think, is just how, if our experience helps us. And I mean, I think it's kind of a loaded question. I mean, yeah, it does in some ways, but then again, it's when you get on the field, it doesn't really matter. So, but I think that's probably the most asked one. And yep, and obviously, he's really good, and it's hard to kind of put into words what he's done and how special he's been. I think it's just um, it's different because it's a different team and just a different dynamic of who we have on the team. But it's similar in you know the moment and and how special it is. But also, I was saying like it's it's cool being in a totally different place like New Orleans compared to Santa Clara. So it's it's really cool. Yeah, we did. We had class Wednesday and Thursday. We started on Wednesday. Yeah, I mean, the first couple of days of class aren't, aren't bad. You know, it's kind of just syllabus day and all that, so you don't have to do too much work, but it's going to be hard transitioning back and when we come back from this game. I do. I mean, I, th I think we needed it. We played in a tough four-quarter game down to the wire. Um, a lot of guys had to play the whole game, and I think we needed that extra week, but it does make it kind of more challenging as far as school goes. Not, not really, not, not off the top of my head anyways. I think they're just, their speed is, is really special and their linebackers especially. And then obviously their, their secondary is really good. But then up front, you know, their D-line are big guys that can move and then they got a really good pass rusher. So uh, just all around the board, you know, they don't really have any weak links. I said that against Ohio State too, but I mean, just both teams are, are really good and they're going to present challenges of their own. But I think the most impressive thing is their speed and just sideline to sideline.